Eddie Malcolm from Old Man Golf. So we're going to do another little three hole uh, vlog today. We're at, at the 15th hole at Kabulcha. I'm just going to do the 15th, 16th and 17th. It's uh, Friday morning, just getting ready for monthly medal tomorrow. And this is the par 5 15th. Uh, dog leg left. You can see there's a large gum tree right down the far end of the dog leg. Um, it's 432 metres to the middle of the green, so I'm just going to lay up to the corner. We take a five iron, nice easy shot up that way. Okay, so I hooked that one. Didn't go right the way through until the 16th fairway, but uh, down here you can see where my hat is down there. That's where the ball is. Um, so I've got two options here. I could go straight down the 16th. I think what I might do is I'm just going to play a little punch shot out towards that tree straight ahead of us. Try and just get back out onto the fairway. So that worked out all right. I uh, got it nice and cleanly with the seven iron. I only just punched it out into the back out onto the fairway and give myself a, a long but a, a reasonable approach shot in from there. So I decided to come out today just to have a bit of a hit around and just to loosen up. I haven't played for about two weeks, so I thought I'd come out and just get it back out on the course and uh, just get myself prepared for, for, the month, for my first monthly medal at uh, Kabul tomorrow. All right, so hit a seven on, then made clean contact with it, but pushed it right. It hit a tree, and it's bounced out to the left. So you know, get some luck some days from the trees. Okay, so this hole, the next one is the uh, par 4 16th. It's a uh, dog leg to the right. The dog leg uh, says on the GPS is at about 240 meters, and that's around about at 100 meters out from the uh, from the green. So driver hasn't been going great so far. So I'm just going to leave it in the bag for tomorrow, and I'm just going to play my six iron and just try and play as close as I can up to the dog leg. I'm not necessarily going to make it, but the fairway down there is pretty wide, so as long as I, I go out to the left a little bit, it'll leave me a decent shot into the hole.
All right, so I've got 148 meters to the front of the bunker from here, and then it'll be a little chip shot up from there. driver not hitting it well just going block just blocking it left have you tried adjusting it yeah i've i've increased the loss on a little bit yeah but not really working so i just i'll see how it go tomorrow i'll we'll start on the tent tomorrow so it's a nice drive we'll pass all this stuff. All right, so I'm determined to play this hole better than I am, but it looks like that four shot I've put in the water um, just here. So I'm just gonna take another drop and play my sixth shot from here. All right, so a little bit of operator error there. Forgot to record the putts, um, but I uh, did a little bump and run with the pitching wedge. Got about halfway to the pin, left myself a couple of really big putts. Ended up with an 11 on that. Um, got to do better on that par five. That par five really cruels me, um, especially when you miss left and then you go in the water and it takes you a couple of shots to get out of there. It's just the par fives that are really causing me to put up big numbers at the moment. But got one hole left to finish the uh, RPL 18th. Not going to video this one. Thanks very much for uh, watching, um, subscribing. Um, the little subscribe button is down in the bottom corner. Share the video. Um, you know, I'm just trying to grow a bit of a, a um, just trying to grow a bit of a, a following. I'm having a bit of fun. It's not the end of the world. Um, I'm not playing in the PGA, so it's not that important. Anyway, have a great weekend, everybody, and I'll catch you around.